for you tonight. Let's start with this man and a woman in Hillsborough County in the hospital tonight. Look at this house. It's incredible. They were seriously hurt after that house exploded in Sefner just after 4 o'clock this afternoon. In fact, the scene after the blast looked more like a war zone than somebody's home. Fox 13's Catherine Holly reports near the scene. The investigation out here is wrapped up for the night. It's still not clear exactly what caused this explosion, but neighbors say it was so powerful their home shook. When I came around the corner, my mouth dropped. Witnesses say they heard the loud boom, then saw a thick plume of smoke. Many rushing over immediately to help or call 911. We're seeing everybody running and stuff like that, and then all you see is like the piece of the house like everywhere, like falling apart, and you see water squirting everywhere. Half the home was reduced to rubble. The garage door blown all the way across the street. We're told that's when neighbors realized people were inside. What I remember is the lady um, yelling and she's still underneath the debris. And thank God our neighbors, some of our neighbors going in, trying to help, trying to get out. He says the Good Samaritans, along with a sheriff's deputy, pulled the woman and a man from the wreckage. She was just hysterical and really panicking. The gentleman, however, looked like to me he sustained more injuries because he was covered in, covered in blood and he, and he was kind of dazed a little bit. First responders rushed the pair to a local hospital with severe injuries, then began combing the scene to figure out what caused the detonation. Most of the home appears to have been destroyed. The house can be replaced, but lives can't. So thank God, and I pray that they'll be okay. Neighbors report they never saw any fire, just the explosion. Hillsborough County Fire Rescue, the Sheriff's Office, and ATF are all assisting in the investigation. I don't know what caused the explosion, but I do know there's no gas in this neighborhood. We're told officials will be back out here on Friday morning to resume this investigation. Reporting in Sefner, Catherine Hawley, Fox 13 News.